Yo, senpai, what are the chances you would land on this? Yeah, Alex Bekur. Before I get to this, I know this is going to disappear soon. The thread, it has been archived. Oh, wow, look at what's trending. Thread archived, cannot reply anymore. By the way, this is not my thread. I promise you have to take my word for it. I don't even have any of my comments. I didn't manipulate. Yeah, I didn't pay for comments, nothing. I'm not involved in this. I happen to land on this. Biz, Reddit, choose your poison, right? Wherever you want to get your information from. And yeah, it's a meme thing. It's a meme world. We can learn. To be honest, there were some gems, hidden gems in the pool of poop, basically. I mentioned this. Whether it's Reddit, internet, this giant pool of poop. Poopoo, -poo, basically. You got to div, dive into it, wear all the mass protective. And if you happen to dig deeper, go down deep, then way like below the submarine level then you might end up finding some golden gems hidden gems and yeah that's what it is anyways before i come back to this it's a very short thread and it's literally what people think about alex bekur yeah the dude has been flashing on x doesn't use his face obviously zss i mentioned this and uh ironically i want to come to this in a second check this out oh wow mark cuban I pay what I owe. Tomorrow I will wire transfer to the IRS. 288. Wait, that's too many zeros, man. Whoa, what is this? $288 million. This country has done so much for me. I'm proud to pay my taxes every single year. Tag a former president that you know doesn't. <laughs> okay, that was a uh, shot. Fired. <laughs> Everything was fine until the last sentence. Tag a former president that you don't know. Wow. All right. I don't want to get political, but I need to show you something here. Oh, NFTs are slowly but surely dying. I talked about Elliot Trades and ZSS Baker, Baker right there, but it's not that. It's something else. Where's the poll? Of course, we have this as well. If you remember, analyzing Elliot Trades, ZSS Baker. Yeah. Wow. 100,000 views. Yeah, because I was paying for it. Engagement. What have, what have to do, man? Like, pay out of my pocket just to expose so-called scamsies. Crazy. But yeah, I'm also testing the algorithm to some extent. Right? It's not like, oh, he's not doing it for himself. Eh, not exactly myself. I'm just trying to test and also experiment so I can tell you what works and what don't. And also earn some good karma. Now, coming back to my stuff. Let me show you this. Yeah, look at this. Six hours left, man. Six hours left to vote. Who did the most damage in crypto space? SBF, Doquan, Elio Trades, ZSS Bekur, Alex Becker, right there. Suzu and Kyle Davis. And I kid you not, Kyle Davis, they have 6.9% versus Elio Trades and Becker combined. 10.6%. I'm surprised. Oh, you're like surprised that they're not in the first top level? No, no. I'm surprised that they're even sitting at 10%. I thought people would not even realize that they did some damage. Huge, huge, massive damage. And they are sitting quiet, obviously. The dude doesn't mention anything about whatever. That's that's how it works in the because in the real world, nobody would face you like, you know, if you bought NFTs or whatever from the person, nobody would face you in real life and be able to confront you and answer questions. That's why they, they are just sitting in the virtual world. I mean, that's a reality if you understand this. <laughs> Tens of thousands of questions, no answers. They're just moving on, milking. They don't even care about reputation anymore. You can call them scammers and do thousands of videos. They'll not even take a stand. You have Mosey who comes and says, does videos. I made what? $21 million in 21 days or seven days. Yeah, but you didn't answer the question. What happened to your gym launch thing? What did you teach? What secrets? All of a sudden you become the guru vitality, the guru <laughs> status. But what did you do? You made all the money. You where from where? Okay, whatever. Nobody cares. Hey, he's poor. Don't talk to him. Just listen to the rich dudes. But how did you make your money? You, you're sucking the poor and you're teaching them how to what? How do you even teach them? Practice and preach? Man, there's no practice there. Oh, man. Anyways, malpractice. So, 10.6 person. Now, let's actually come back to this. Yeah, you're still around. Senpai, I know you're going to make it. Hey, by the way, this is a very racist thread. I do my best not to even... So if there's a word that pops up, I will not say it out loud. I don't want to hurt anyone's emotion. But hey, listen, this is crazy. And lately, one thing, Biz has announced that people need to sign up and use their email address to 
comment and all that stuff, which means it's going to make it difficult for scams and spams or whatever, random stuff to pop up, manipulating, you know? A lot of people shill garbage. <laughs> it's crazy what I've seen on this forum since the beginning. Like, it's just become a funny, like, clown show circus. Do you think this manlet, manlet, what kind of word is that? Is really down to 80% of his net worth and tens of millions of dollars, like he claims? Or is he posturing? Manlet, yeah. He has become a total manlet, man. Something is off about him. I, I kind of know this. See, I study, I see it. You're like, yeah, judging. Bruh, we all are judging. No, I'm not judging. I'm analyzing. There's the right word. I'm analyzing, man. Yeah. All I know is that he's a cocaine addict. Dude. Oh, whoa, whoa. Okay, that, that's that's hard. He was into gaming coins, right? Would check out. Sorry, I can't hear what... what... Yes, he tells his lemmings that AI and gaming shit coins are safe bet. Lemmings. Yeah, he has lemmings followers. I mean, that's what it is. It's real. People who can't see stuff. Who Who is he and why should anybody care about the degenerate? Nick Tattoo, Tattoos, who is he? Okay, he's this epic Giga Chad who makes shit and dick jokes and tells people to put their net worth in shit coin flavors of the month. Alex plays. Thanks for the hearty laugh. Net worth? Okay. You have more than I do. Hmm. Biz doesn't like Alex Becker. Checks out. No money will grant you the ability to reach the top shelves on stool. No, he's just, hey, I'm a midget too, man. I'm barely, like barely 6'5'7". Uh, yeah. Alex is probably a little taller than me. And you guys are criticizing him? All right. He's a lemming and I'm a midget. Oh, shit. No, he's making fun of his followers who actually are while he makes 100 million a year. Oh, wow. Yeah, he actually is making fun of everyone. Because he throws a coin, super, super is gonna moon. And then next day, it dumps because, of course, insider, they just keep milking, right? And he laughs at you all. He's like, I told you, I never told you to buy. I just said super is gonna moon and you bought it. God, 100 million a year, whatever was business. He couldn't give a shit anyway. Yeah, what business? Like, hmm. yeah, everybody claims they have a business and they make money, but nobody sees the money. And then they make it through crypto under the table then channel and launder or whatever and then they come and say hey look this is the money i made yeah okay okay what is this <laughs> come on look at yeah, this is crazy how do the and what how do the fibula ends each yeah this explains a lot i watched some of his stuff a couple of years ago since i have really minimalistic myself i'm okay i'm really i live minimalistic myself and cut a lot of stuff from his my life I was rather interesting to listen. It was rather interesting to listen to his rumblings, ramblings, sometimes even funny. Yeah, sometimes it was like he throws the same joke over and over again. But just something about him seemed off. Dang, this guy is pretty much on point right now. Yeah, even if you agree with someone on many things, you start to get the ache if they seem obsessed with it. He clearly has some kind of mental problems. Hmm. Dang. He can just ask for 2x. Yeah, that's what I said. Like he can put 100k. And you guys pump it to like just double the money and he just that's easy because that's more confident like in a way because when you have the following you can dump on it's like safe pretty much safe safety net like hey i'm i guarantee this is gonna move moon because i know it's gonna i'm gonna talk about it they're gonna buy it and i'm gonna sell so i have my bags are guaranteed <laughs> my profits are guaranteed i mean i'm talking about the dudes right <laughs> he's a grifter oh hold on hold on let's read this if hey, you're almost there at the end He's a grifter, shill, and a horrible traitor. Maybe there is some hope for gaming though. I have a bag for the ship empire that he shills. It's pretty low market cap. Yeah, he's been doing this for a long time. Same thing with super and all that stuff. Come on, come on. You know they're gonna get away with it until it hits the thing. The DOG or whatever lands on my vo the poll or my thread and they're like, hmm, Houston, we have a problem. MC, and if gaming does run, at least I have exposure. If it doesn't, then I delete my other coins in profit. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. And that's it. My portfolio did a negative 69 per person, so... Yeah, that's exactly what happens when you listen to man that's like Bekur. Anyways, ladies and gents, what do you think about this, dude? I just wanted to put this out there because he's one of the most famous influencer, confluencers out there. And uh, just analyzing, not judging, analyzing. And based on my analysis, I'm presenting you all this stuff, information and data. So you can, you know, save all your time, do the right stuff, enjoy with your family and not get scammed. All right. And if you haven't voted, maybe just go and vote and I will see you in the next vid. Peace.